Hi, I'm Joe with Rocky Mountain Boot Fitting and I uh, want to go through one of the most important things you can do uh, during the day. You know, you can go spend time with a really good boot fitter, but if you forget to put your boots on correctly, it can ruin your day, you know, so it's something that, uh, take the time and do it correctly. You know, we'll start out with the sock, okay? We want something thin. Thickness is actually going to slow down your circulation and make you colder. So get something thin, you know, get a good material and it's going to wick moisture, it's going to be breathable, um, and it's going to keep you warm. If you have issues after that, then you have a circulation circulation issue and we can talk about heaters and things like that later. But a sock like this should be able to do everything you need it to. When I'm putting on my boots, I'll take and I'll flip them over, flip your micro adjustments over. Um, you'll see people sitting there fighting in the parking lot in the cold, frustrated, and they're not even looking. And all of a sudden, this buckle relaxes and they can't even get their boot on. So take this time to do these, these little things that will make a huge difference. I've got everything unbuckled, and then what I'll do is I'll stand up, I'll grab this tongue strap, put my foot in and pull straight up, okay? Slides right in there like a champ. Make sure everything's lined up correctly. Most boots come with these straps nowadays, but myself, I like to take both hands, grab this liner, pull up and flex forward. You can feel it. You can even see it. Everything just goes, sucks up around your heel, your Achilles. Um, you know, if you don't line the liner up correctly in the boot, you're going to have issues. After I do that, I'll make sure everything's overlapped correctly and I'll just give it a tap. Don't be busting it hard. You'll see people doing that, and they're getting recoiled. Those toes are going right back to the front. The liner's getting pushed back. Um, so just give it a little love tap, and then I'll start with the ankle buckle, okay? Have your buckles work for you, not against you. Um, you know, you'll see people doing this too, and they're going straight to that, and they're shaking, just trying to get that ankle buckle shut. And all you have to do is take your time and go one buckle, one buckle, and just have them work for you, not against you, up and down. So you get that support you need, okay? Um, right there, what that does is that's just locking that heel down. When I'm hanging out at lunch, I don't adjust that because I've got good support there. And when I'm walking through the lodge and things like that, it's holding that foot off the front of the boot. After I do that, I'll stand up, flex forward, get everything aligned up there correctly. And then I'll do my toe buckle and instep buckle. On a good boot fit, these buckles should be barely buckled anyway because the shell fits you, okay? Do your power strap last, okay, line that up, flex forward a couple times, go hit the chair and have a wonderful day.